Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Miss Lauren Lee 11 and today, as promised, I'm going to be showing you how to do a wash and go, very simple, with hair grease and gel. I've shown you how to do a gel wash and go, I've shown you how to do a hair grease wash and go, and now I'm combining the two because it just looks so good. So I just want to say thank you so much guys for all your suggestions of the type of videos you'd like to see from me on my YouTube community. If any of you guys are new to my channel, you can subscribe now. Go ahead to my YouTube community, leave your comment down below and let me know what video you would like for me to do. I'm going to get to every one of your suggestions guys. I'm going to see if I can do every one of them. Someone suggested Bantu knotting and I'm not that great at doing Bantu knots, but I'm going to try. I am. I'll give them a whirl. All right guys, right, let's start with fresh hair. Today I have fresh hair. I washed my hair a couple of nights ago and I haven't put anything on my hair. On my scalp I had to put some hair grease because my scalp was itching and very dry. But other than that, this guys, be prepared, is my natural hair, no products. I'm giving you a bit of Miss Ross hair. It smells divine. I noticed when you don't put any hair products in your hair and it's just shampoo and conditioner, it smells all soapy and just, whew, it smells good. Oh, by the way, guys, let me show you the hair grease that I actually put on my scalp. If you have or haven't seen my last hair grease product review, which is the last video, and I will link it at the end of this video, which you can click on after. It was one of the hair greases that I used in that video, and it is this. I've got actually two tubs of this, so this one isn't just, I haven't just scooped it, I have just slapped it on my head. This is actually an old tub, and it's this. It's the Cream of Nature Argan Oil, and it says day and night, hair conditioner. Now this is what I used for my scalp. Just greased my scalp last night and then I just massaged it like so. And now my scalp is not itching, it's not dry. There you go, so my scalp is prepared. What I'm gonna do, because you know, we don't wanna apply hair products to dry hair. And as you can see, my hair is kind of dry. Not crispy, it's soft, but dry. So we don't, we don't want to be doing that because that is the mistake. If you know Miss Lauren Lee 11, Miss Lauren Lee 11's phrase is moisture is key. Okay, so that's what we're going to do. I'm going to re-moisten my hair with my water. And then guys, this gel I'm going to be using, if some of you remember, i done a video on this gel and I hated it. But you know what? In this current climate, we don't have time to be wasting products and throwing them away. And you know, it's a whole tub of gel, so I might as well just use it because it's gonna be fine, um, fingers crossed, with hair grease layered on top of it, I'm hoping. And the product I am talking about today, guys, is IC Fantasia's Jamaican Black Castor Oil Styling Gel. I still have a lot left. And to be honest, I haven't actually got any other gel, so <laughs> I'm just gonna have to use this one. Yeah, well, I weren't a fan of this, but to be honest, maybe it's because it didn't have hair grease on top of it. So I'm going to be using this and then I'm going to layer it with my favorite grease for doing a wash and go because it has such an amazing hold. And if you have guessed, yes, you're right. It's the Blue Magic Indian Hemp Hair Grease. I'm not putting a leave-in in because all I'm doing is putting the moisture on. This I feel is good enough to have as a leave-in, I guess, because it's got moisture as well. And then I'm going to seal it with the hair grease. So yeah, let's just begin. Guys, I will also state that uh, the reason why I like using hair grease for a wash and go is because it takes less time to apply. So all I'm gonna do in this video, guys, it's very simple because I've done so many wash and goes. I'm just gonna show you this section, how I do this section on camera, and then I'm gonna come back to you with the end results when wet, and then the end results when dry. So just stay tuned. All I'm doing now, guys, is just smoothing down the hair strands, just basically preparing it for the hair grease so there's no tangles in the middle. I forgot, it smells like incense sticks.
The reason why I'm making these smaller section, guys, is because I want to make sure it's right on my roots. I do not like having flat hair and puffy roots. That it just looks like regrowth, and that's not a look I'm trying to go for. And yes, I'm being heavy-handed with the gel just because my hair is just lightly damp. It's not very wet. I like to do my hair usually on soaking hair, but as I said, I washed my hair a couple of days ago, so. Now it's time to seal it in and I'm starting off with a little amount. I may go back in for more but right now I'm just going to start with this and see how it applies onto my hair. A little bit more and I think that's it guys. So that small amount is basically all you need. voila moisture sealed okay guys as i said i'm gonna go and complete the rest off camera and then i will see you in a bit okay guys so i am back now and these are the results if you can see my hair is clumped nicely because after a time with hair gel in my hair the hair starts to separate and go to individual curls where it wants to go hair grease clumps it together and when my hair is dry it will stay like this unless i start playing around with it look i'm doing it now let me just show you the back Oh, it's that simple so guys I do want to say I thought I might bring this up basically I had a comment just to say um, what's wrong with shrinkage now I don't want my hair to shrink up because this is the style that I'm going for basically there's nothing wrong with shrinkage I've mentioned before I love shrinkage because it shows how healthy my hair is the elasticity that my hair has and I enjoy shrinkage but it's just preference for this particular style. I don't want shrinkage, I want elongation. And what helps with the elongation is the hair grease. Anyway, I'm gonna go out now. Hopefully my hair will start to air dry a bit quicker and I'll come back to you when my hair is completely dried. So stay tuned guys. Hey guys, so I'm back. This is the next morning. So it literally is close to 24 hours, maybe 22 hours of drying my hair and yes I am wearing the same shirt as yesterday because you know I didn't have a whole day in my outfit and I wanted to finish it off. I've got to do the school run now so I've got to be quick but I'm just going to come back and show you. I've done my makeup, I'm ready to go and I'm just going to let my hair down. My <laughs> No pun intended. So <laughs> my hair is now 100% dry. I slept with it up like this last night. When I put it up, it was slightly damp, so I'm kinda a little bit nervous. Slept with my body on top, but I'm just gonna take it down and show you now. Okay, so these are the results. I can't see how they look myself. I have got a bit of shrinkage. I'm gonna go and stretch it with the hair dryer, then I'm gonna come back, sort out my edges. I'll come back to you guys. Let me just fix up. Okay, guys. There you have it. These are the end results. So, what do you think? I think it kind of resembles a twist out and I really like it. I stretched out with a hairdryer. I didn't stretch it too much, just a little bit because I don't want the curls to, you know, just look flat. But I did have to reapply, just, but this is just because of the gel. I did have to reapply hair grease just at my roots because where I had manipulated my hair and put it up, uh, it started flaking. So, uh, I won't be buying that again. <laughs> but I did the job for now, so. Anyway, but as I said, these are the results, done my edges. I love the layer of hair grease on top of a gel wash and go because obviously it keeps my curls in, keeps them clumped, and just keeps it nice and fluffy and light and sealed and moisturized. Okay guys, I've got to go, I've got to get the kids to school. I will see you later. Thank you so much for watching this video. And if you have any more requests, you can leave them on my YouTube community, as I mentioned before. I still got some more videos of your suggestions that I've got to work through. So yeah, that's it. So don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share, all that jazz, follow me on Instagram. Thank you so much guys for watching and I will see you soon. Bye. I'm going to be doing a natural hair product review and I'm going to be seeing which hair grease I should use. And it's nice, it's very nostalgic. It's very nice. Ooh.
Okay, I don't like the smell of this one. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.